Cruz residents, you could soon see more than $20 million in drainage fixes. Mayor President Sharon Weston Broom is leading the new proposal. Our Anam Siddiqui joins us live in the studio. Anam, I understand Mayor Broom wants to speed up work already on the calendar. That's right, Tavarius. This almost $20 million would speed up drainage cleanup. One flood, one flood victim I spoke with today says she doesn't see hope for change. President Sharon Weston Broom is asking city officials to spend almost $22 million from the COVID relief fund to help clean out drains in East Baton Rouge Parish. Transportation and Drainage Director Fred Rayford says the project's first goal is storm drains. Come up with some locations of about 3,000 locations that have storm drain boxes, uh, pipe that are anywhere from 25 to 75 percent blockage. We can get on to those fairly quickly. That's welcome news for people like Brandy Polson, who lost everything during last month's flash flood. I'm at lost for words. Rayford says this project is more than regular storm drain cleanup. The East Funds here will provide the opportunity to expedite some additional issues that we see out there based on the storm water master plan that was provided this information on the blockage, blockage of the storm drains. Our staff cannot handle the volume at this point, but I think with these additional manpower uh, and contractors that we can do, I think we'll make a great um, hit on the drainage in, inside the res, residential subdivisions. Polson says she has seen multiple efforts to help drainage, but the change hasn't been what's promised. She hopes this project will make the difference. I hope they clean the servitude behind yep. our house. Drainage behind us, it needs to be cleared out. The project was introduced at tonight's Metro Council meeting and will be back on the agenda in two weeks for debate and then vote. Back to you guys.